Available in two or four wheel drive, the Ford Cougar is one of the strongest models in the crossover SUV market and boasts the same high qualities as the rest of the Ford range. Pitched as a cross between an SUV, an MPV and a large family car, the Cougar drives and looks like a tall Ford Focus. The Cougar features the same kinetic design language as the Mondeo and Focus, but also features some subtle styling touches such as vents and flared wheel arches. Get inside and there's a recognisable Ford interior with a reassuring sense of quality and durability on both ZTEC and Titanium specifications. There's also an excellent driving position that makes for good visibility and a real sense of security that makes crossovers particularly appealing to families. Front, side and curtain airbags are standard and a 5 star Euro NCAP rating will also appeal. The cabin also features clever details like a pocket for sunglasses, numerous storage spaces and elbow rests that will please drivers who rack up long miles. Features such as a keyless start, heated windscreen and adjustable seats as standard will also please drivers. The Cougar will see 5 adults in comfort and storage space increases with the rear seats up. Another clever feature is the dual tailgate, making access to the boot easier in crowded areas. As for driving, the Cougar is again reminiscent of the Focus, in terms of its excellent driving manners. The 2 litre diesel engines are smooth and torquey, with enough pull through the range for any driver, with good economy and emissions making for strong running costs. For drivers seeking more performance, a fast 2.5 litre petrol engine is also available. A power shift gearbox will also appeal to drivers racking up long miles on the road, while front wheel drive or four wheel drive models can be specified in the Cougar range. Four wheel drive models offer good off road ability, but the Cougar's strength is on the roads. The Ford Cougar is a strong all round proposition that may offer the best drive and the best looks in the sector.